What's up, fight fans? Welcome back to KO with Kyle. I'm your host, Kyle. Today we'll be doing a fight spotlight of the upcoming bout Valentina Shevchenko versus Jennifer Maya. This bout will be the co main event at UFC 255 on November 21st, and it'll be for the Undisputed Flyweight Championship. Valentina Shevchenko is the current flyweight champion. She won the title versus Joanna Jonjajek in December of 2018 and has had three successful title defenses since. Valentina is five wins in her last five fights. Jennifer Maya is three wins and two losses in her last five fights. Jennifer Maya is a Brazilian jiu-jitsu black belt who won her last fight via armbar submission. Jennifer, ba- Jennifer Maya was a professional boxer before switching to MMA, so she should be pretty solid on her feet. Valentina Shevchenko competed in Muay Thai and kickboxing before joining the UFC. She actually beat Joanna three times in Muay Thai before joining the UFC. Valentina has three performance of the night bonuses. Jennifer Maya has one performance bonus. And now on to their last five fights. In Valentina Shevchenko's last five fights, she is 5 for 5 with two performances of the night bonuses. She beat Priscilla Cachoeira by submission with a rear naked choke. Following that, she beat Joanna Jerzejcik by unanimous decision. Next, she beat Jessica I by KO. Shevchenko then beat Liz Carmouche by unanimous decision. And most recently, Valentina Shevchenko beat Caitlin Chukugian by TKO. In Jennifer Maya's last five fights, she is three for five with one performance of the night. She lost to Liz Carmouche by unanimous decision. Following that, she beat Alexis Davis by unanimous decision. Next, Jennifer Maya beat Roxanne Modaffery by unanimous decision. Then, she lost to Caitlin Chikugian by unanimous decision. And most recently, Jennifer Maya beat Joanne Calderwood by submission with an armbar. Jennifer Maya may have the boxing advantage, but Valentina is always calm and measured in her approach. Shevchenko is able to trip and secure takedowns, but I'm not sure how much she'll want to be in Maya's guard on the ground. I think the overall striking advantage goes to Shevchenko, and she should be able to get it done if she can avoid the grappling from Maya. I will have a forecast video of the full UFC 255 card the week of the fights, so please subscribe so you never miss our timely content, and until next time, fight fans, peace.